Ruby and I have timed it perfectly for you this afternoon to show you around five Tinner Pistith here in Trous Finnith in lovely bright sunshine. We're both dressed up in our colour match coats so let's go and have a look around the inside and show you all the character and comfort on offer here. Come on Rube, let's go. The cottage might be opposite a main road, but it's got a fantastic outlook of the hillside over there. It is a cottage, I'm five foot seven, these are low doorways. If you're a six footer, you'd better mind your bonds. As you come in the front door, the stairs are immediately ahead and the room strikes you as being quite spacious. The beamed ceiling gives that cottage effect. It's got nice wooden effect flooring and wall lighting. This brick fireplace makes a nice feature. There is an oil-fired stove here, and it is new, but it's never been commissioned. If you wanted to install a wood burner here, you would have to change the flue to suit it. At the far end of the lounge is a dining area, and there's plenty of space for a table. As well as the beamed ceiling, these pine doors add another nice cottage feature to the property. Let's through to the kitchen next. The kitchen's well fitted with modern units. There's an integrated oven, hob, and integrated fridge. The oil fired boiler's in here on our left, but the great thing is it's got this lovely high pitched roof and vaulted ceiling. And the roof window lets in the sunshine. You can see here the house has got UPVC double glazed windows and doors, so that improves insulation and keeps down the maintenance. Whilst we're up this end of the property, let's go out in the back garden and have a look there. So these steps have been built to give you easy access up to the back here. Up here it's completely overgrown and it needs uh, some of your own inspiration on it. But you can see it gets the sunshine beautifully and I think a raised deck or something here could be fantastic. This shot is taken from the top of the garden and you can see the long sloping roof on the back of the house. No flat roof here. Um, that lower velux is the kitchen window and the other two windows are for the bathroom and back bedroom. <laughs> I'm glad you're still watching. Up here we've got the landing, three doors off here. They're all pine with these nice uh, cottage style latches as well. This is the front bedroom. It's comfortable double size. And this dormer window provides you with another good view out the front. This second bedroom is a single, but it's used as a dressing room at the moment, so uh, there's no furniture in here to assess the size, really. Just like the kitchen, the bathroom's nicely fitted and up to date. It's got a roof window and a white suite, and there's a shower over the bath. The floor's also tiled out as well. Ruby and I have loved showing you around five tin of pistons in the sunshine this afternoon. To sum it up, it's got comfort and character, and provided that you don't mind the main road opposite, I think you're gonna love this cottage if you come and have a look at it for yourself. Give me a call on the usual number if you'd like to come and view. It's written on the board here. And in the meantime, if you'd like to subscribe to Sanderson Estate Agent's YouTube channel, you'll be notified of other future videos as well. Please give me a call if you'd like a video of your own house too. I'm Andy Sanderson, this is Ruby. Thanks for watching and we hope to see you soon. Bye bye now.